Hey guys, it's Abby. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be throwing together 10 simple and easy freezer meals that I can have for postpartum after the baby. And I'm gonna share with you how to do it in about 30 minutes. almost 37 weeks I am running out of time and I'm starting to think about how I'm gonna feed my family afterwards obviously my husband helps me too it's not just me but I'm just a planner and I like to know that I have some meals planned ahead of time so I have started looking into some super quick simple freezer meals to have to throw together for dinner so that I'm not stressing myself out with a baby and trying to cook. So these are all going to be meals that we're tossing into a freezer bag and we're gonna freeze. And when it's time to have that meal for the day, you're gonna toss it in a crock pot, let it cook, and you'll have a little bit of prep for the actual meal, but that's it. And all of this cost me $70 for 10 meals. I'm super pumped and I think you're really gonna like it. I went to Aldi uh two days ago and i bought i'll show you this is all you need for the meals and i spent 68 dollars and 72 cents and i labeled my bags already so i have five meals i'm going to show you and i'm doing them twice just because of convenience so i have all of my bags labeled that's going to be the first step i have mentioned this before in a video and I will link that video up here. I am getting these meals from a really affordable meal planning subscription. So this is $5 a month and it is called Eating Together. It is a monthly meal planning subscription. You're gonna get an email once a month and in that email is gonna be an attachment for a month of meals planned out for you and it's gonna have the grocery list already made it's so convenient you can put the meals on whatever days of the week you want you can substitute things um, it gives you the instructions on how to cook it it is so good and I'm planning on doing this pretty um, regularly after I have the baby because the grocery lists are already done I really think a lot of people could benefit from this. A lot of times the planning part and the grocery shopping and the making the list is the inconvenience. And this takes the inconvenience out of grocery shopping. One thing I wanna mention, some of these meals, like for instance, this one is like a hamburger helper. It's like a homemade hamburger helper. I'm not throwing in noodles because I don't wanna have cooked noodles thrown in a crock pot all day, they're gonna get mushy. So in the instructions, in the meal plan, it tells you the order of steps of what you need to do. So that week when I'm planning that meal, I'm gonna go back into the meal plan and read that, oh, I need to make sure in this week's groceries, I buy noodles for this meal. Okay, so some of them have some other items that you will need to prep very quickly that evening but the majority of the meal is going to be in here in your freezer and they last three months so i'm not putting the date on them because i know we're probably going to use these within the first couple of weeks and i think that's it so let's get started hopefully i can do this really quickly my daughter's napping and i don't have a lot of time
right guys, and there are my 10 meals. Um, sausage gumbo. I've got two salsa verde chicken, two hamburger mac, two creamy chicken pine, and then two honey Dijon chicken. So the easiest thing ever. I was able to do that in 30 minutes, put it all together. Now I'm gonna squeeze out all of the air Put them in my freezer. I have a deep freeze and they should be good for three months. We're gonna eat them probably a lot quicker than that, but all of these I'm just gonna dump in my crock pot on the day that I plan that meal and then I will add any other produce sides or things like that that are not ready now. So 30 minutes of prep for 10 meals is nothing compared to taking so much time during the week to make meals it's really going to make your life easier thanks for watching i will see you again next week hopefully unless this baby makes an entrance take care of yourself and i will see you again next time bye everyone